Hi and welcome. My name is Rafael Taubinger and this video is about cross-platform build tools for ARM. We all know that embedded systems uh, complexity has been growing and uh, also the teams uh, have been growing. So uh, we all talk about automated workflows and uh, maybe the best way to explain this is actually uh, if we uh, look uh, in an example of desk to uh, CI. So uh, that's mainly an example uh, of a scalable build topology. So uh, we have, uh, of course, uh, IR in Webbit Workbench uh, being used, but as we move to the automated builds, uh, the IR build tools uh, for ARM, of course, fit in a perfect way uh, in these uh, workflows. And uh, you can even add uh, CSTAT for uh, code analysis. So if we look on the IR build tools uh, for ARM, uh, they actually uh, include uh, the compiler, uh, the linker, uh, the assembler. Uh, we also include uh, the IR command line build utility, uh, so named IR build. And finally, CSTAT for uh, static code analysis as add-on. Uh, these tools can of course be used from uh, Make, Ninja, and include all uh, the excellent uh, outstanding code optimizations. And the best thing is actually that it's cross-platform. So we provide installers uh, for uh, Linux Ubuntu, Red Hat, and also uh, Windows. So this is perfect for scalable build uh, topologies. And you can even uh, do it in a containerized way. Uh, I mean, using uh, dockers for uh, the deployments. So uh, let's have a look in the tools in action in our cross-platform example. Yeah. So great, uh, we have here uh, Windows and uh, Ubuntu open here uh, on the terminals. On the left side you can see Windows, on the uh, right side you can uh, right side you can see Ubuntu. And um, we want to demonstrate IR build tools as cross-platform. If we start here by looking into the project uh, that we have, uh, we created a project with IR embedded workbench. So we will use this demo.ewp as input. Uh, we have um, the same on uh, Ubuntu. Uh, if you want to have a quick look. So if we start uh, by invoking um, the compiler here on uh, both sides, first on Windows, to see the version that it's used, we can do the same actually um, here um, later on Ubuntu side now. So if we look uh, on the compiler being used uh, here on the uh, Ubuntu terminal, uh, you can see it's um, actually the same version 9.20, but uh, for uh, Linux. Great, so if we just want to start the build here, we can use IR build and uh, use the demo.ewp uh, file and then we can choose uh, build and uh, which configuration we want to use. Also, always good to run it in uh, parallel here, the parallel build capability. So it's starting the build here already on Windows. We can do the same on Ubuntu. We invoke IR build and exactly the same uh, project name here. Uh, the syntax is uh, pretty uh, the same. We will do the build and um, of the demo and also uh, parallel build uh, enabled here. This should just take a few seconds to uh, finalize here and uh, the output that we want to see it's actually the demo.x uh, that it's already available here on Windows. Same here on uh, Ubuntu. Uh, so it will generate exactly uh, the same uh, outputs here. The functionality will be uh, the same. What we can also do, uh, we can invoke CSTAT and it's very straightforward. Instead of doing the build, we invoke CSTAT analyze on the command line here and it will just start analysis. Same for uh, Ubuntu here, you know, running uh, they are uh, build tools. We can do the CSTAT analyze here also. And this might just take a few seconds here. Good, so it's completed here on the Ubuntu side and if we were just to load the results, that's also very straightforward. Uh, we can invoke um, here um, the database that is generated from CSTAT and then we can load here uh, the results and have a look in what warnings have been uh, generated. And as you can see, it's the list here, uh, depending on what you have enabled, uh, Mr. C. We can do the same here on the Windows side, uh, load um, the messages that have been uh, generated the database that sees that always generates and as you can see um, depending on what you have enabled miser c search c uh, all the warnings are uh, being displayed here so you can do the build 
and also uh, CSTAT code analysis uh, in cross-platform. Great! And finally, uh, I would like to thank you for your attention. I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, please reach out to fie at or just visit ir.com slash dxarm. Thank you.